Hi everyone, welcome to Amrita IAS Academy. So in today's video, let us discuss about glacial burst which is considered to be one of the major reasons for the 2021 Uttarakhand floods. The 2021 Uttarakhand flood began on 7 February 2021 in the environs of the Nanda Devi National Park, a UNESCO World Heritage Site in the outer Garhwal Himalayas in the Uttarakhand state. It is believed to have been caused by a landslide, an avalanche or a glacial lake outburst flood. It has caused flooding in the Chamoli district, most notably in the Rishiganga River, the Dhauli Ganga River and in turn the Alagananda which is a major head stream of the Ganges. Glacial lakes are common in the high elevation of glacierized basin. They are formed when glacial ice or moraines or these natural depressions impound water. There are varieties of such lakes ranging from melt water ponds on the surface of glacier to large lakes in side valleys dammed by a glacier in the main valley. These lakes normally drain their water through seepage in front of the retreating glacier. The moraine creates topographic depression in which the melt water is generally accumulated leading to formation of glacial lake. When this lake is watertight, melt waters will accumulate in the basin until seepage or overflow limits the lake level. Such moraine dammed lakes appears to be the most common type of glacial lakes. So the impoundment of the melt may sometimes be unstable, leading to sudden release of large quantities of stored water. Failure of these ice or moraine dams leading to disastrous destruction events has been documented throughout the world. Flash floods caused by the outburst of glacial lakes called as glacial lake outburst flood are well known in Himalaya where such lakes had often been formed by landslides. These floods have immense potential of flooding in downstream areas causing disastrous consequences due to release of large volumes of water in very short interval of time. Most often, the consequences arising out of such situations are highly unpredictable primarily due to lack of availability of sufficient data regarding rainfall intensity, location of landslide, impounded volume, and area and physical condition of lakes or water bodies. Therefore, glacial lakes and water bodies in Himalayan region need to be closely monitored. The National Disaster Management Authority guidelines suggest that Risk reduction can be done by identifying and mapping potentially dangerous lakes, taking structural measures to prevent their sudden breach and establishing mechanisms to save lives and property in times of a breach. The floods at Uttarakhand have claimed many lives which come as a deadly reminder that this fragile, geologically dynamic region can never be taken for granted. Hope everyone found this video very informative. Until we meet again, goodbye and thank you. Amrita, IAS Academy.